Hey guys, thanks a lot for tuning in to the Chalk Me Out podcast with me, Narayanan. In today's episode, I'm joined by a very close friend of mine from all the way in Cambodia. He is a podcast host, a number one education podcaster in Cambodia. He's a certified life coach and I follow him for two things. One, the way he has worked upon his life for self-improvement and learning. Second, how he has read over 50 books every single year for the past few years. So this conversation is going to be a lot about knowledge, about careers, about how do you find peace with yourself, with the kind of things you're doing. So let's get started. The journey that you spoke about uh, sharing with people and you also figuring things out in your life, I think that's yeah. that's the same process for me as well. Uh, mm-hmm. The more I share, the more I want to learn, the more you know I'm figuring out. And also through these conversations, you know, uh, these these interviews that I do with folks like you is one for my audience, but then there's a part of it which is also for me because I think mm-hmm. we're on the same boat uh, and learning can come from anywhere. Yeah. I was really interested, Johnny, that you uh, did your uh, bachelor's in arts uh, and now you're working with uh, one of the largest, uh, you know, self-learning or personal development companies. You've been doing that for the last three years. I want to know how the journey, you know, came together uh, Mm. and then we'll jump on to how you balance working and your podcasting. Yeah, actually, my degree is more like uh, in English literature. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I, I don't know how to make use of that. <laughs> but uh, <laughs> I chose the degree because it was easy for me. Uh, because I think my English proficiency back then was pretty good. So I'm kind of like an easy ticket out of university. I mm-hmm. I did enjoy learning in school so much. So I thought like, hey, I, I need a degree. Maybe it's a safe uh, thing to have, right? Uh-huh. Uh, let's say my job right now, though we recruit people without a degree, but it's also, you know, uh, in Malaysia, there's some rule and regulation in immigration, right? Like uh, if yeah. you have a degree, then it's easier to get a visa, right? Even the company doesn't need, but it's the law. So okay. then, yeah, that was kind of my thing. It's just like, hey, go to school and spend a lot of time outside of university. Uh, just like you, like we 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 we've met each other in ISEC. So I spent yeah. uh, quite a bunch of time there, uh, volunteering, uh, meeting people. And throughout those experiences, it kind of like uh, shaped me in a certain way in wanting to explore more in uh, the area of developing myself. Because I think mm-hmm. when we, back then, like when I was exposed to so much challenges, I'm kind of like, yeah. Hey, I experienced burnout. I experienced so much stress and I don't know how to deal with it. So I, it kind of got me to, uh, growing myself because back in the day doing ISEC yeah. it was very difficult right absolutely it's very very difficult yeah and and it pushed me to develop myself and also I think uh, because like the the company that uh, you mentioned like uh, in, in my family it's like be very uh, how can I say very f- open to getting people who who love growing themselves and also it's also an ISEC partners and so on so yeah. I'm kind of like hey uh, maybe it's a good uh, opportunity for me to explore. And when I get yep. in, I think it, it was very nice. Like uh, it's a lot of like-minded people and also many resources that I can use to learn. And I, I can say I grew a lot like through, throughout those experience and yeah, throughout the challenges, throughout the content, mm-hmm. throughout the people, but especially, yeah, yeah uh, a lot of valuable networks uh, from it as well. So that's all for today's episode thanks a lot for tuning in i shoot these daily munchies out on mondays wednesdays and fridays in case you're not subscribed to this on whichever application you're listening to i'd highly appreciate if you do so and if you're listening to me for a while now your ratings and reviews would take this podcast to the people that want to listen to me you can also give your feedbacks and reach out for any questions that you might have on narayanan at the rate And until I see you on the next episode in a couple of days, have a very, very lovely day. 
and make sure that you own your life.